Hi, Assalamualaikum uh, So, uh, for today's lesson I'm going to explain about Solving non-linear system By using newton raphson methods So, previous in our previous topic You have learned newton raphson method In solving uh, uh, the root of an equation So, the formula for newton raphson method Is xi plus 1 Equals to xi minus with f of xi divided by f prime of xi okay but now since we are solving for non-linear system so this is non-linear system suppose our equation is f1 xy equals to 0 and f2 x y equals to 0. So this is the general form of this non-linear system. We have two equations with two unknown, the first equation and the second equation. Okay, so uh, we cannot use this formula because this formula only to solve for f x equals to 0, only for one equation. So we need to modify a bit this new Raphson method and the new formula uh, for solving nonlinear system is x i plus 1 y i plus 1 since we need to solve for two variables is equal to and this i x i x i here is the initial gas so our initial gas is x i and y i minus with so for non-linear system, we have another um, another term, J negative one. J is the Jacobian matrix. Since we have two equations in this system, so our Jacobian matrix is size of two by two, and J negative one mean uh, the inverse of this Jacobian matrix and multiply with F1 XI YI F2 XI YI and this one also XI YI so this is the Newton's formula in solving non-linear system where this j here this j is equals to delta del f1 del x del f1 over, over del x means you find the partial derivative of the first function with respect to x and the second element del f1 over that y so this one is the partial derivative of the first function with respect to y and this one is the f2 over del x the partial derivative of the second function with respect to x and this one is del f2 over del y the second function uh, you differentiate the second function with respect to y so this is your Jacobian matrix to use this Newton's formula, we need to invert this Jacobian matrix. So recall back what we have le you have learned in your secondary school. If your A, matrix A, A, B, C, D, matrix of the size 2 by 2, to find the A inverse, you need to use this formula. 1 over determinant of A, which is A, D, minus B, C, multiply with... This A and D, you change the place to D, A. B and C, you just change the sign of this. So, negative C and negative B. So, this is the formula of A inverse. So, this uh, same for this Jacobian matrix. To find J inverse, the formula is 1 over determinant of this matrix, which is A, D. So, these two, you multiply. So, del F1 over del x multiply with del f2 
over del y minus v and these two you multiply it together del f1 over del y multiply with del f2 over del x okay. and then you multiply with this value here so del f2 over del y this one these two you change the place del f1 over del x and these two elements uh, the place remain the same but you need to change the sign so negative del f2 over del x and this one is negative del f1 over del y okay so make sure you find uh, the jacobian inverse first by using this formula and then you substitute it into this newton's formula to solve for this non-linear system Okay, now please pause this video and please copy this formula in your notebook because this formula is not written in your textbook. The textbook use another formula. But I, I prefer you to use this formula because I think this one is easier as compared to the formula in our textbook.